The Archbishop of Enugu Ecclesiastical Province, the Most Reverend Emmanuel Chukuma, has urged the judiciary to endeavor that justice prevails over the trial of the former Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Walter Onore, on his case of non-declaration of assets. It will be recalled that the Chairman of Code of Conduct Tribunal, Tanladi Umaru, in his judgment some weeks ago, found Onore guilty of the charge brought against him and banned him from occupying any public office for the next 10 years. Reacting to this, the Archbishop urged the judiciary to ensure that justice and equity prevails in Nigeria. Archbishop Chukuma made this known while speaking in an interview with ACNN news correspondent Wanne Ogechuku in Abuja. There's a lot of witch hunting. Whatever judgment you have now is premeditated. And there's nothing you can do than wanting to nail the man. And all efforts they are trying to do is to make sure that uh, Onore doesn't come in because of the influence they want to have over the judiciary. There's a hidden agenda by Mr. President. So I think what they have done is to make sure they just get rid of that man. And no amount of advocating or soliciting for that man that could help. But I think the man was also very much uh, fed up. Hence, he resigned. So. All these things, you want to tell me that whatever you are talking about, or not, all these people who are, including the people who are in service chiefs, how many of them have declared their assets? How many of them? Because I've declared the declaration of assets. The worst people in the government, the worst people in the government of Buhari that have not declared their assets. We don't see whatever is happening is wrong, is right. But why are you saying we chanted in particular about him that he has not declared his assets? How many of us know the assets of Mr. President or even the chief of staff? Or even those who are civil service chiefs, how many of them do we know their assets? How many of them who are there that's working, working as principal officers? So I think uh, we are talking about equity and justice to prevent Nigeria, and that is not happening at all. The cleric also stated that the lesson to be learned from Onore's saga is that nobody is above the law. He also admonished Nigerians to ensure that whatever business they are into is legal. This is a lesson for Nigerians that whatever height you may be, the law will catch on you. So we must be very careful. Whatever we are doing, that's another side of it. Because if you think that you are untouchable or you are immune, then you have to be very careful how you live your life. And then if you have a source of fund which cannot be proof, then again it's a trouble, it's a trouble thing. So people in the judiciary should be careful now and let there be justice in the high court because these people are out to mess up the judiciary. And so whatever you acquire, Make sure you are quiet in the right means and when you are asked to declare, declare it and know that the source of this fund or what you acquire is genuine. 